We'll look at a um, couple of problems where we're calculating the course and distance by Mercator sailing. So we're given initial and final positions and asked to calculate a course and distance. So we see here our initial and final latitudes both southerly um, therefore we should have to subtract one from the other. Mercator, meridional parts from with it be Mercator sailing we get those from the Norris table and of course whatever we do with the latitude we do with the mer parts so we subtract one from the other. Longitude uh, we're going from 169.50 east to 161.42 west so obviously we're going in an easterly direction and the simple way to get the d long value is to add these two together and subtract from 360 and that will leave you with 2808 and you notice in dark print we've converted d lat and d long to minutes it's very important you do that you cannot use those values in degrees in um, in your formula so we can work out our course then what's important is that when we work out the distance we must put our course to at least five decimal places in the formula here must be to at least five decimal places to work out our distance because that will give us a more accurate distance and see there our answers 42 degrees 50 distance 2011.5 we'll look at another one here where we're going from Cape Town to New York and what I've done on this one just as an example is to draw approximate positions with arrows indicating the direction we're going just to show that that's a way you could ensure that you name your course the correct way and also notice on this one we're going from south to north and what's significant here is of course that we have to add the latitudes because we're going from south to north and whatever we do with the latitudes we must do with the meridional parts so of course we add those as well once again convert to minutes put into the formulas remembering to name your course to at least five decimal places and then that gives us our course and distance so you might find it useful just to do a little sketch to help you to um, name the course um, correctly.